Thursday morning each week, our stalwart engineering types get together to do essential maintenance on our boats and gear. Afternoon, Robert. Good afternoon. The biggest topic of convo these days are what is going on over at that bar. Two days ago, MSQ issued a new NTM, clearly showing that the old route is silted up. They have set up two AIS beacons to help larger boats navigate one of the alternative routes, with a third option discovered by locals going further south and bum squeakly close to the beach. And due to a strong wind warning for later today and tomorrow, we've decided to take a look for ourselves. And found the dredger not dredging once again. The holdup was due to losing some gear and needing to do running repairs. Our footage shows a diving company engaged to a search for missing gear. While in the air, we decided to take a look around to check the best route. With tide at high water and little swell and wind, the entrance looks quite benign. But at low water and with a freshening wind conditions may change a lot. At this point we came across Malulabar Rescue doing a community service ashes scattering. They navigated the entrance gingerly, plotting their course over the bar with care. This especially so as the dive boat had taken up a central location with a diver down searching for missing pieces of the disabled dredging gear. For the coming weekend, we are hoping to capture more drone footage of the entrance at low water on Friday. But with 80% chance of rain forecast and a strong wind warning and also low water at around sunrise and later at around sunset, this may not be possible.